Hey everybody, Terry Bradley here again, simpleswingthoughts.com. This short video on the grip and the posture is going to relate to your left wrist position at the top of your backswing. And of course, if you're a left-handed golfer, your right hand, um, right wrist position on the top of your backswing. Now, as we always promote that the grip and the posture always precede anything we do here at Simple Swings. Because the two simple swing thoughts obviously is the grip and the posture. So when you think of the grip and the posture like we said, and if you haven't reviewed that video, go to the grip and the posture video, review that video first, come back to this one, and you'll know what we're talking about in terms of our grip and our posture. But in this video, we're going to talk about the left wrist position. So much talk about the left wrist. Okay, A lot of people like it bowed. Uh, Dustin Johnson, if, if, you, if you follow the PGA Tour, he's got one of the bowest wrist uh, actions coming through the ball. Okay. Uh, more like Tiger and, and the other players, they're more flat, okay? Um, uh, it varies. It depends on what your flexibility is in your wrist at times. But notice how when you have your grip and your posture right, notice how it's going to basically be in the right position every time. And here again, you don't have to think about it, okay? So as I um, grip the club, I'm going to have Rachel get a um, close-up on my left wrist as I, as I stop at the top of the swing. So if I'm here and I come back, see it? That's, see that left wrist? That's a perfect left wrist swing position to actually come down into the ball, hands over the ball, then the release is through the ball on the follow through. Okay, now I know, uh, see a lot of you at the range who are always looking at your left wrist, make sure it's flat. If you grip the club right and your posture's right, the left wrist will follow, okay? Here again, I'm over the ball. I'm not thinking about it, it just happens. So I'm over the ball here, grip and posture's right. So as I come back to the, to the top of my backswing, I'm here, see it, there it is. It's in perfect position to drop the club into place over the ball. See, it's not, it's not this way or it's not too bowed this way. It's right there, ready to drop into the ball and follow through toward your target. Okay, so again, practice that. Grip and posture, again, puts you in all six or seven major swing positions in the golf swing. You don't have to think about it. And once you get those two thoughts down, you'll be playing golf without thinking about it and having more fun and playing more, uh, more nice golf courses around the country and, and having a good time. Okay, again, my name's Terry, and I'll see you on the next video.